It is time to honor another great teacher, and today we find her in Aiken County. Brad Means here with her story. And Belinda Anthony teaches at Chucker Creek Elementary School. She's been at it for 31 years and is showing no signs of slowing down. That sure is great news for all her smart fourth graders. She's this week's winner of the Golden Apple Award. Belinda Anthony is following a trail that her great-great-grandmother blazed for her many, many years ago. She taught at Old Hickory Grove, which was on SRS property, and she used to go to school with a shotgun over her shoulder in case she had to shoot a snake along the way. Today, her students are working hard in their centers. We are finishing up um, our colonial unit in our reading block, and we're in our Revolutionary War unit also. So they're doing some projects. We had um, some centers that are now leading into a project-based learning. And so they're getting ready to do some colonial occupations. They're doing a sign for that. And they will teach each other about what each job does. That's right, they'll help teach the lesson. It's a key part of the way Ms. Anthony gets the kids to buy in. So you have to have like a community in your classroom. So they help each other and they help me. <laughs> I couldn't do all of this without them. And they could not make such big strides without her. When they come to us, they're not very independent. And then usually about Christmas, we start to see a big change and they become a lot more independent. And we start kind of pushing back and making them do a lot more on their own. Congratulations, Belinda Anthony, helping children by just doing a job she loves. I just enjoy children. Um, I think I found that that was what I was called to do. If you know of a teacher who deserves the Golden Apple Award, just let us know. You can go to WJBF.com and click on the Golden Apple link and you'll find a nomination form.